This is Anne from Happy Your Mom Home Cooking. I'm making tofu and green bean stir fry today for lunch. Uh, but first thing first, I'm gonna show you how to make um, uh, steamed brown rice on the stove. I usually just do it in the rice cooker because it's quick and I don't want to worry about the rice can burn. But for the purpose of this video, video, I will show you how to do it on the stove. Here I have one cup of brown rice that I've rinsed. I'll add it to a small to medium pot. Also, I have two cups of water. I will put it on the stove, turn on high heat to bring it to the boil, to a boil. Then I will turn off the stove and let it sit in there for 30 minutes just so the rice get rehydrated. Um, then after 30 minutes, I'm gonna turn the heat back on and let it steam for about 15 to 20 minutes. I here, here I have one block of tofu, which weigh about um, 400 gram or 14 ounces, uh, one and a half pound of green beans or um, 700 grams. And to make a quick sauce, we'll add a third a cup of water, two tablespoons of soy sauce, two tablespoons of poison sauce, Um, in case you're wondering, this is for um, serving Vietnamese um, summer rolls or uh, Vietnamese noodle soup. One teaspoon of cornstarch. One teaspoon of rice vinegar. And one teaspoon of sesame oil. We'll cut it in half. And then again then I'll cut each piece into six rectangles like this we'll dry it on a kitchen towel before frying it so it doesn't splatter too much and this is for tofu by the way the rice has come to a boil so um, I'll turn off the heat and let it sit there for 30 minutes I have two cloves of garlic I'm going to chop. I also have a quarter of an onion. I use red onion because I also use red onion for my curry. That way I only had to cut one onion. I'll trim the beans and cut them in half. To the green beans, I will add about one tablespoon of oil. And I will also add some oil to a nonstick pan to, to fry my tofu. I can hear the sizzling from the pan. I'll give it a quick stir. It's about 400 degrees. Frying pan. Cover it over the screen so the oil doesn't cover too much. It's been about five minutes for the beans. The onions and um, garlic is smelling really nice. I will add to this half a cup of water. Cover it up a little bit. And turn down the heat a little bit. And uh, we'll let it steam for 10 minutes. The tofu is nice and golden on one side. I'll flip over. I'll 
let the tofu fry on the second side for another couple minutes. I've tried um, different methods for cooking tofu, but uh, frying it in, in a nonstick pan with a bit of oil it gives the best result. My tofu is done. keep some tofu plain um, in case the kid doesn't want it in the sauce later. Sometimes I do and sometimes they change their mind. The rice is in the boiling water for about 30 minutes. I will go ahead and Turn the heat back on. Oil, the water is starting to boil. I will keep the lid on, but I just leave a little crack open for the steam to escape. And we will um, set a 15 minute timer for that. My beans are almost done. I'll add tofu and sauce to this. Turn the heat on the rice to medium. This stir fry by no means is authentic. I just use whichever ingredients I have in the fridge and that I can find at my local grocery store. Feel free to come up with your own recipe and adjust it to your family's taste. As long as you like it, it doesn't matter if you follow a recipe exactly. I'm not very good at following recipes either, so I, my food kind of tastes different every time. Even though I wrote this down to, um, to give you an idea of what to cook, I, I don't really read it every time I cook. I just kind of cook based on what I remember from the last time. The sauce is thickened and my stir fry is done. Okay, I'll come back when the rice is done. I'll I'll show you uh, what it looks like.